Hi folks. Today, we're gonna dive into something that impacts your lives every day, consent. Consent is all about choice and freedom. It's your right to say no, to change your mind, and also your choice to give an enthusiastic yes. It's about thinking it through, tuning in, communication, and respect. I'm Jessica. And I'm Eli. Let's get started. First things first, what is consent? Consent is all about giving and receiving permission. It should be a voluntary agreement that people enter into freely. When it comes to your body and boundaries, it's vital. Acting cool, being polite, or trying to fit in should never mean that you don't have a choice in what happens to your body. You know what? Heaps of young people learn about sex through friends or online, whether that be through social media, TV, or through watching pornography. But here's the thing, relationships in real life are about checking in with each other and making sure everyone is okay. Let's break it down. Consent is a set of skills that we all need to have. This includes knowing yourself. Take some time to think about what you want to happen. What are your boundaries? What might happen and will this be okay or not okay? Are you feeling scared, excited or both? What can you do to be as safe as possible? Caring about other people. Just because you feel or want something doesn't mean others feel the same. What does the other person want? What are they into? How can you tell? And obviously, if they are wasted or asleep or out of it, they can't consent. Skills for consent and asking. This means figuring out what we all want. Not just one person, everyone should have a say. Consent is about using words, body language and expressions. Is the person moving away? Are they freezing? Or are they initiating things? You can also ask things like, I like it when you do this, or keep going. Or is it okay if we try this? This way, everyone can decide on what feels good. This isn't always easy, but it shows you're considerate, which can be hot. Reflect. Take some time to think about the situation. What did you do or not do? How do your age, gender, disabilities, culture, and your sexuality shape your experience? And how's the other person feeling now? Consent isn't fixed. Mm, your feelings may change and that's okay. You might feel a yes for one thing like attention or a kiss, but then realize you want to slow things down or even stop. You might say that you're into something online, but that doesn't mean that you need to do it in real life. Consent is ongoing. This means you need to keep checking in and figuring out what's okay. We've been talking about consent and intimacy or sex, but it goes beyond that. Like, can I use your phone? Can I share pictures? Can I tell others about us? Can I post about us on social media? But remember, it's not just about asking a question. It's about making sure the other person feels safe and comfortable enough to give an honest answer. Have a think about whether they are okay to say, no, I don't want you to, or whether they might feel pressured into saying yes. Consent is all about respect, communication, and understanding feelings, ensuring everyone's safety and comfort. These consent skills apply to various aspects of life. Remember, the golden rule, everyone has the right to say no change their mind, or give an enthusiastic yes. If you need help or have any more questions about consent, you can call Full Stop Australia on 1800 385 578.